born right here in Texas. Yes, he's a Texas fella. But more than that, he's played everywhere from Grand Old Opry to the Louisiana Hayride. And he recorded, which we consider the rockabilly anthem. And what's that? Ducktail. Absolutely. More importantly than that, he's incredible. This band's incredible. Y'all are incredible. And what I need you to do is put your hands together and say it really loud for Buckle Up, There We Go, for a Texas fella. Bring it up, bring it on, nice and loud. Rudy Chitty Grizzell.
this guy is for something else. Yeah. 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 And Michael Rowe, the board of shore, hallelujah. I'll admit to you, like Elvis told me, your songs are nuts, Rudy, up again. You know, bro, I, uh, I'm uh, very thankful. About a year and a half ago, I uh, did some character work for Mr. Clint Eastwood. A movie called Mercy Man, and it'll be out maybe a year, a couple of years. Office of John Sex. And uh, when we did the last day in Carmel, Clint Eastwood said, Rudy, Tootie, he said, you're full of shit, but don't change. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and folks, that's, I tell it like it is. Remember that song, tell it like it is. Uh, that's the ice story. This is dedicated to uh, our director of the FBI, J. Edgar Hoover. <laughs> he passed away, but I didn't know this, that when he took showers, he liked to dress up like a lady. <laughs> so J. Edgar, baby, that's great. Y'all are going to help me out on this when we say, ah, all right, let him go.
actually judged from uh, Spain. Spania. All right. Met him, uh, how many years ago? Another friend of mine that I did a lot of shows back in 1998 at a place called Antones. It was the Texas Tornadoes. That was uh, Freddie Fender. Flacco, Audie, Audie Myers, oh yeah, and of course, Doug Songs. One of the best. I was very fortunate to have Doug in my band when he was 11 years old. I took him with him, put him with me, an appearance to Louisiana Hayride. So I know Doug. He's up there watching us, along with Elvis, Freddie, and all of them. And here's a song he wrote to me. to the owner of the motel. So during the night, 
the girls brought in, put a mannequin in Elvis bread, I mean in bed, and put another mannequin in my bed. So you know how that goes. In my mind, I said, God, she's hard. She's very hard. And Elvis said, what in the hell is going on? I said, Elvis, I don't know. He said, turn on the lights. He told me, so we turn on the lights and we go scream. You know, when you're drinking. Bodies, carriage of arms, hats fell all over the place. So that was one of my great experiences with Elvis. Thank you, Elvis. <laughs> So can I use your imagination on that one? You know, you're drinking. You have to put a mannequin in your bed. Oh. Take your hands out of your pocket. The girls aren't here yet. Thank you. Here's a, another song was written for me for Eddie Dugas when we had Little Duck Sun Gone. Little thing entitled One Mile. Let it go! Yeah.